Hi all, welcome to the channel Cloud Knowledge. Today in this video, we'll be doing a quick labs exercise that is a lab on Google Cloud, which is getting started with Cloud Marketplace. So here is the lab page, okay, and here's the start lab button. Lab will be enabled for 25 minutes for us. So it is Google Cloud Fundamentals Lab getting started with Cloud Marketplace. In this lab, we will use Cloud Marketplace to quickly and easily deploy a LAMP stack on Compute Engine instance. This LAMP stack, what it is, it provides a complete web development environment for Linux that can be launched in one click. So here, on the, on the right side, we have the different tasks given here. And once we complete the task, we can mark the task as completed here to check the progress. So we simply have to follow it. So if you have access to Quick Labs and to this lab, you can follow the instructions. And in case you face any issue, you can refer to this video to get the issue sorted. So comes the task one. We have to sign in to the GCP console. Okay. And here it is written. The first step is that we have to sign in to the Quick Labs using the incognito window. So we will open an incognito window. So the command is control shift N. It will open us a new window which is incognito window or we can open from here the incognito window then the next step is note the labs exist time and make sure you can finish within that time so 25 minutes are allotted to it we have to finish in that duration okay there is no pause feature you can restart if needed but you have to start at the beginning okay so we'll try to finish the lab within 25 minutes when ready click start lab note that your lab credentials username and password you'll be using them to sign into the Google Cloud Console. So we have to note down our lab credentials and we we'll log in to the lab using our credentials. So once we click on start lab, we will get the credentials. We have already opened the incognito window. Now we'll start the lab. So let's click on start lab. Yeah. So here it's written. Username, password is given to us, project ID, region and zone. Okay. So here is the open Google Cloud Console. So here we'll right click and we'll copy the link address. Why we are copying? We are, why we are not directly opening? Because we want to open it in incognito window. So here in the incognito window, we'll paste the link. Okay. So we here we have pasted the link and the username here is this. We will copy the username and we'll paste here and click on next. The password, password is also given to us for this lab. So we'll paste the password and click on next. Okay, so we'll click on I understand. So this will open us the Google Cloud console page. Okay, we will agree here to the terms of service. You could see the very first page of Google Cloud console here. We have performed this task. Now we have to go to the task two. Use Cloud Marketplace to deploy a LAMP stack. So the first step is in the Google Cloud Console. On the navigation menu, click Marketplace. So if you go back to the Google Cloud Console, here, this is the navigation menu, okay? On the extreme left side at the top. And under the navigation menu, we have Marketplace. So we'll click on Marketplace. Okay, in the search bar, type LAMP. Okay, we will open this so this is the marketplace page open for us in the marketplace we have to search for lamp okay click on enter it will give you several results now next next step is in the search results click for lamp packaged by bitnami if you choose another lamp stack such as uh, the google click to deploy offering the lab instructions will not work as expected so we have to only select lamp packaged by bitnami so if we go further down, further down, further down. Okay, so here comes LAMP package by Bitnami. We have to click on this link. Next step is on the LAMP page, click launch. If this is the first time you're using the compute engine, the compute engine API must be initialized before you can continue. For zone, select the deployment zone that the Quick Labs assigned to you. Okay, so the zone assigned to us here is US Central A. Okay, leave the remaining settings as their defaults. So the page opened. We have to first click on launch. So let's wait 
for this to launch okay so the page appear for the lamp package by bitnami overview the deployment name will leave it as is the zone it is set in the instructions of the lab to select the same zone as the uh, for the zone we have to select the deployment zone given by quick labs so the assigned zone is us central a and here it is showing us c so we'll select a from the drop down okay and leave the remaining settings as their default so we'll leave it as is so the deployment name zone machine type whatever is there by default we leave it machine type is there series boot disk networking settings everything will leave it as is we'll accept the conditions here the terms of service will accept and deploy so this is going to deploy lamp stack 1 is being deployed let's wait for this to complete so click deploy if a welcome to deployment manager message appears click close to dismiss it okay so let's wait for it to finish and the status of the deployment appears in the console window it is being deployed when the deployment of the infrastructure is complete the status changes to lamp stack has been deployed so it is still being getting deployed and once it is deployed okay we can click here to check our progress if we now click on check my progress so the lamp stack deployment is completed here the check progress is uh, green tick and if we go back here you can see that it is shown that it has been deployed it contains some warning but we'll ignore the, those warnings next is to verify the deployment when the deployment is complete click the site address link in the right pane okay so the site address, address link is there at the right side this is the right section and the site address link is here so we'll try to open it in a new tab let's go here and we can see that it has given us a message you are now running with nami lamp in the cloud okay we'll go back here to your new site so we have open the site address here and we could see the message that we are running with nami lamp in the cloud okay so this is done next is close the congratulations browser tab and on the console uh, the get started with lamp package by bitnami we have to click the ssh secured shell we have to click so here getting started it is shown this is the section it is talking about and there is an ssh button we'll click on ssh it will open a new window for us if we go back to the settings here if we go back to the instructions in, in the just created ssh window to change the current directory to opt bitnami execute the following command so we'll copy the command from here okay this is the button to copy so it will take us to the bitnami directory okay so we'll go to the ssh window here this is the ssh window and we'll paste the command okay so it is cd op bitnami we'll click on enter so now we are inside opt bitnami directory to copy the php info.php script from the installation directory to a publicly accessible location under the web server document root execute the following command okay so this is the command to copy the script we will copy the command from here and we'll paste again in the ssh session so we'll click enter so this is copied the php info dot uh, php script displays your php configuration it is often used to verify a new php installation now we we'll click on exit we'll give exit so this window will close yep open a new browser tab type the following url and replace the site address with the url in the site address field in the right pane of the lamp stack page so we'll copy this url okay we'll go back here and into a new tab we'll paste it and in the site address we have to put this address 34 66 164 and 54 it is 34 66 164.54 now we have to click enter okay so if you go back to the task a summary of the php configuration of your server is displayed so php configuration summary is displayed correct the version of the php then the system build it and other configuration related details are all displayed here right all the details are here on this 
page. The summary of the PHP configuration is displayed. We will close the PHP info tab. This tab we can now close because this was the script we copied using the SSH session. So that script is showing us here. We have closed the PHP info tab. Next is congratulations in this lab. You have deployed a LAMP stack to a compute engine instance. So this was a very basic fundamentals Google Cloud Lab on the Quick Labs. You can type this on your Quick Labs account. And thank you for watching the video. Happy learning. Bye.